Teddy swims. I can't make you love me. First time reaction coming up in 30 seconds. Hey, it's Matt Crisqualo coming to you up close and personal with another first time reaction. This one came requested by my buddy George Ibrahim. Uh, George Ibrahim is also the first guy to turn me on to Dimash for the first time and so, so many other great uh, artists. So I'm uh, indebted to George. And at any rate, let's get right to this. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel, please. Stay in touch so we can keep doing this and keep the party rolling. And if you want to buy me a cup of coffee, I do love coffee. You can do it in the description and I will give you a shout out. So example, uh, I got a coffee from Ronnie Heyman, Sean Bressy, and Rachel Dacus. Thank you very, very much, guys. I appreciate that. Anyway, let's get right to it, shall we? This cat's got a great voice, man. He's one of those people that can, that has a gift of uh, of a great voice, but he also is using it in his in, in a very uh, beautiful way. You hear all those those uh, textures and colors, and um, yeah, yeah, all that stuff in there, huh? You know, when I see guys like him, too, you know. Look, we all have our own stories of suffering and pain, right? Anyway, I could hear that coming through. I could hear that, and we can hear that, right? And you can't make your heart feel something it won't hear in the dark. In this final hour, I will lay down my heart, oh. and I feel the power. But you won't. And you know, he's doing that thing that a lot of the um, gospel and uh, black singers started doing a long time ago, which is where they're just, just a hair sharp on the note, you know, just a hair sharp on the tone. And it's, 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 um, <laughs> I don't know how to describe it, man. But it's very effective, and it just goes to show you that you can be on the bottom or the top of the tone. You can be anywhere on the tone as long as you do it deliberately and intentionally, and you're doing it in a certain tasteful kind of way, you pull it off. I'll close my eyes so I cannot see the love that you don't feel when you hold. And I'll do what's right Just give me till then To give up this fight mm. I will give up this fight Cause I can't make you love me If you don't And you can't In this final hour, I will lay down my heart, and I feel the power, but you won't, no, you won't, cause I can't make you love me if you don't, and you can't Something in war Here in the dark In this final hour 
put you on. I gotta tell you, man, this guy, I love his vibrato. I love his vibrato. It's got this deep kind of almost like, you know, vibrato, vibrato, you know, if you got this straight line and that's your tone, right? Vibrato has like a wave length that goes just on top and on the bottom of that tone. So you're actually touching a little bit of the sharp and the flat of the note. And depending how 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 big that wave is, you know, you can actually go to the next note above and below it. <laughs> you know? And this cat, you know, and what he's doing is when he's going to, when he's hitting his peaks and valleys, there's like a little bit of a space that he's throwing in there, just ever so slight. And it, and it, um, I don't know, man, I dig that kind of stuff. I'm thinking also when I play the saxophone and I play with vibrato, I may, I, I might try to think about incorporating that because what it does is it, it's, it's actually creating a rhythm too, you know, so it's, it's taking a tone and actually adding rhythm to the tone, but he's actually accentuating that rhythm just a little bit more with a little bit of a break in his tone when he's utilizing the vibrato. It's a little complicated, but when you listen to it again, you'll know what I'm talking about. Cause I can't make you love me if you don't. They're sweating my eyes. I'm not really crying. This looks like it though, don't it? <laughs> oh boy. He could have probably not even said anything there and we would have thought he was crying. Not that he, I'm sure he does because he was crying through the music. He was funneling that, that kind of uh, feeling. I'm hoping he was anyway because if he wasn't then he's a very, very good actor but we wouldn't believe it. And we do believe it. The guy is great. He's wonderful. I love the way he sings. Uh, you can hear a lot of his influences. You know, he, he's definitely listened listen to R&B and a lot of, uh, a lot of uh, soul and uh, hey, listen, I can appreciate that. It's good to be turned on to this cat, uh, Teddy Swims. Where's he from? What's his story? What's he all about? Let me know in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to become a Patreon member like, uh, you know, like uh, Paul Clark and Elmar Winkler, George Ibrahim, some guy, Don G and Dev Helen, you can be a part of this cute little uh, movement that we have here too. It's only the as little as a cup of coffee you can make a difference anyway guys thanks a lot it's uh, nice to be important but it's more important to be nice and uh, you take it easy and if it's real easy take it twice <laughs>